What's up, bro? It's Brazo from Neptune, New Jersey. I stay in Keyport. These are my homies right here. That's my cousin Key. That's my boy right there, Chris. Man. Good. I'm a rapper. He make music. That's my hustle right here. So basically, I got into this rapping shit a few months ago. Not too deep. I'm a, maybe a little bit more than a year. Just trying something new. This is what I want to do in my life for now. You feel me? And we just hustling, man. Trying to get paid to support our families. Really, at the end of the day. That's all I'm really worrying about. Oh, God. Oh, God. Niggas don't got time oh, for that extra bullshit. I'm just trying to get to the paper and be out. You know what I'm saying? But basically, up here in Keyport, shit the burbs, but niggas in the burbs ain't the burbs. You know what I'm saying? But like, if you come up here, you finna be straight. If you just mind your business, basically, get some paper, get a job. See, I work. He work. Everybody work. You know what I mean? But niggas got side hustles out here. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So it's like, basically, not really. I just be chilling. Nigga, you know niggas in school, summer out now, nah, we finna turn up, my homie Smooth, we just linked up with him for the first time, got me right, you know what I'm saying, but we finna be out here the whole summer, turning up, making tracks, getting paper, videos, all that, bro, we finna be taking off this summer, bro, free my nigga E, long live D, and long live Pop Bud, bro, free all my bros, and a lot of my niggas to death, and you say something about yourself too, man. Shit, I made music, started last year, you feel me, I grew up in Newark, then I'm in Jacksonville, Florida now, you feel me, all that. I work just just to get some bread up so I could start getting my music and shit. Got an at-home studio and all that. You feel me? I'm just trying to get this shit popping and all that shit. You uh, feel me? Got him onto this shit, really. Mainly, I tried getting him to get on that shit last year with me, but he started this year. You feel me? All that shit. Take time, dedication, and all that shit. You feel me? I started on the phone, so I ain't really... I ain't have much. I start. I started working so I could get all the studio equipment and try to get into a studio. And Let all him that know. Shit. Let him know. You feel me? Also, I'm about to. I'm trying to real estate next year, and then I got a clothing brand coming up soon. So I'm trying to doing that shit. BFG Key, my guys. Yo, go follow my KJ dot official on IG gang. Follow me at Brave dot Murder B R A three Z's dot Murder three A's. You feel me? And my homeboy Chris right here. Follow him. What's your shit? Uh, Chris Mark, 57. Type shit, Chris Mark, 57. IG, bro. Get my homies to death, bro. I don't go fuck nobody say. We be in our own lane, mind our own business, trying to get some paper. I don't go fuck. I got a good crowd around me. We got a good head on our shoulders, you feel me? So we get into the paper, bro. Really. We ain't got enough time for distractions. We just trying to get to it. You did. Shit coming up. We about to be 18 soon. We trying to be, you know? Trying to be out the way, gang. Wait, talk, talk about yourself, though, Chris. Let them know who you is, gang. Shit, I'm just a supporter out here. I'll be supporting everybody. You know, loyal shit. Just trying to get to the money, man. That's about it. Hell yeah, just man. trying to stack up my bread. That's it. Any way I can. But uh, I'm gonna get into this real estate shit later in life, though. Real estate, where the money at? Honestly, I got some clothes and shit coming out maybe soon. Cool. Why I saw shit, me, Young Slimy and Reckless. You feel me? That's my shit. Key got some shit. Chris trying to get into that shit too. We got some shit. Alpha L Nano. We gonna get into that. Alpha L. That's my last name. We ain't gonna get into that though. So just know my last name start with an L. For L, you know, just for life. Alpha L Nano. Nano is my block I grew up on. Ninth Avenue, Neptune, New Jersey. I went to Midtown Elementary. You feel me? And I go to Keyport High School. Shit like that, though. Right. How are the teachers over there? In Keyport? Yeah. Oh, they be on deck, gang. I just got suspended today on the last day. What? Yeah, because like, today was the last day I got suspended. On the last day. Type shit. But I came in the motherfucking. Basically, she put her hands on my face, put her back up. She took it the wrong way. I got kicked out. And they told me to walk home. I just left the school front door, walked home. Basically, they just be on hella dick over there. You just, well, niggas be trying to mind their business, basically. <coughs> he in my school, too. And you even ask him, it's the same shit. Yeah, they be on dick. Hell yeah. Niggas just stay fucking with niggas for no reason. And niggas just trying to mind their business. I don't be talking to niggas. Everybody got their problems out here. You heard? Everybody got their problems, bro. But at the end of the day, bro, I don't give a fuck about none of that extra shit, bro. I'm trying to just get to the paper. You see where I'm at right now, right? You see I'm on this couch? I'm in here in the booth. Niggas ain't in the booth right now. You can't be on the block. You can't be on the block and sweating and not getting no paper. That make no sense to me. I can't be on no block sweating, not doing shit with my life. I gotta be on the block getting paper with my homies. I gotta do something productive with myself. You dig what I'm saying? It ain't gonna be no bum, nigga. I ain't trying to be 40 years old still living up in this town. I'm trying to move. I'm trying to go down south. Yeah, no, it's there's really the bigger things than like Union right. Beach, Hazlitt, and Keyport. Yeah, like, there's you gotta understand. There's niggas that only be around here. Like. They don't go to like they don't never been on a vacation or anything. Well, they only know Keyport. Yeah, I feel you. That's like cause like and most niggas don't got the opportunity. Here. Most niggas don't got the opportunity to like really go anywhere. You feel me? Because their situation not right. But yeah, a lot. Not everybody's situation right, but 
everybody got somebody who hustling this to try to get them right because they ain't have it. You dig what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So niggas can't really be mad at that at the end of the day. Like, my pops, I ain't gonna lie, phone number Sherm, but he a square. I ain't no square, but it's what, it is what it is. At the end of the day, he's still my dad. You dig? He did some fool shit. Like, you know, niggas know, but he did some fool shit. I'm taking the heat. Shit like that. It's not on me, though, but at the end of the day, I still love that nigga because he's my pops, but like, you know, mama's on that shit. I ain't even trying to get into that, but you know. What you guys think about YouTube? Like, YouTube. oh, I started that shit. I tried starting that shit when I was like seven. Me I too, gave up man. on that shit. I think everyone did that shit though. You feel me? Yeah, I tried you that shit wanna... too. I never blew up though. I'm still fucking trying. Uh, yeah. Now you doing good though. You got like 17k on that. Yeah. You're doing good, bro. Thanks. Like, you, like, I'm really inspired by that. I ain't gonna hold you. I tried streaming the other day because I'd be running 2k sometimes with the guys. Literally crazy. anybody could start up a YouTube like I feel like uh, that's yeah. everybody's dream starting up a YouTube channel. Yeah. yeah. Dude, everybody they make that. like forty times what we be making at these Popeyes and Best Buy. Yeah. yeah. It's real hard. Like I YouTube, want though. this YouTube money so bad. I wish like I hope it happens one day. See, I got a I got a I got a cousin that make YouTube. He had like I think he got like ten, twenty thousand on there. But then he his shit got banned. They they canceled this shit, so he had to make a whole new thing. He he trying to make music too. Yeah, he and he in town. Oh my god, Isaiah from a server. Nigga trying to make some shit out there. What flavor Nick is that? <laughs> <laughs> I can pee that shit. <laughs> Yo, nah, but I saw that YouTube shit too, but I ain't got nothing on it though. That shit fresh. I don't even know my name on YouTube. I ain't even gonna lie. I don't even gonna lie. I can't do YouTube no more. That's nah, that the shit only thing I was doing YouTube was post for music, honestly. Like and like later in life, I'll probably like do like you know like videos like some real shit. Like you gotta really like be posting videos of like nah, for real. your face and shit and all that. Like but yeah, you really gotta entertain and all that shit. And some some people some days you don't got energy for that shit, so you can't yeah. really post every day. Like and people expect you. I'm a lazy nigga. I be sleeping. Ask niggas. Ask my home. Ask my cousin Lil. Shout out to my nigga Khalil, bro. All he be saying is. All I be doing is eat, sleep, and smoke. That's all I be doing, bro. Eat, sleep, and smoke. I be sleep till like five on the M. Uh, Key be sleeping. Key just woke up. He almost, he was almost late to this motherfucker. Yeah, nigga wanted me to come down here. I woke up at like one. I had, a, I rushed in the fucking shower and all that shit, and got a ride over here so he could do his shit. Hell yeah, we just dumped in the booth. Well, I just dumped in the booth. Homie hopped on the island with me, and my homeboy Mons hopped on the island too. Ain't gonna lie. But Monty is sleeping too. Ask, ask Monty about the sleeping schedule. Good looking, yeah. guys. You know, yeah, you be, be out sleeping. there. You, be, you, know, you, do, you know, you're the knocker. Yeah, I'll be sleeping. <laughs> Shout out to him. that, bro. You be sleeping. You be sleeping, bro. Gotta get the sleep schedule right. Hell yeah. It's important. My boy playing sports right now, though. He a mean ass football player, bro. Real shit. He'll sack many of your niggas out there. So, I don't really play with him. He's on the keyboard football team. Hell yeah, yeah. number 57. What position do you play? D tackle. D tackle, bro. Big nigga. Oh, God. I don't play with that nigga, bro. He's doing good for himself. That's why I never play football, because niggas like you would tackle the fuck nah, out of me. Nah, bro. I can't play football. I'm a skinny nigga, you feel me? I'm a soccer player, basketball type nigga. I used to play football. Yeah, Until my knees shit. gave up. Yeah, Key got some, like, granny knees, God. Yeah, I used to play Like, you guys are taking the, you, it's, you know what I mean? Like, that you guys, that's the real shit, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, you're getting bruised up, really damaging your body. That's nice. Nah, it's love, though. It's love. That's my, favorite. That's my yeah. first love right there. That's his family for real. I ain't gonna cap to you, bro. All that nigga football. do is fucking live football. What uh football team do you like? I like the Ravens. I like Lamar. Did you like your pick this year for the draft? Oh, hell yeah, Zay. Me too. What's not good about nah, the Ravens? No. You nah, can't, I like the Giants. Let's not get talking about football because niggas know I don't like football. <laughs> Lamar, man, my guy. You don't like football? Nah, man. Damn. Because I'm not gonna oh, lie to you. I ain't never catch football the hang like of that. it. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not nigga, bro. I'm not gonna lie, but I just never caught the hang of football. Nah, football that. Yeah, I never watched it really. I, I like basketball. That's what I'm looking Do you like basketball? Basketball. Yeah. I stopped playing though. I had surgery on my legs. What did you think about the 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 game this year, the Nuggets and that shit was crazy. I turned it off. It was kinda LeBron boring, lost. but the Nuggets got, got it. They tell I didn't care about the Nuggets, man. As they, oh, there's they a lot of Heat fans in Jersey, they, they bro. They just play boring, but I'm they not tough. even the Heat fans. Them niggas is ass. The Heat did get ass low key for the past like five years, yeah, but they trying to make a little comeback with um Jimmy and um Kyle. Jimmy and Bam. Yeah, yeah. Kyle, Kyle off the bench. Kyle off the bench. Yeah. Jimmy, I'm still, not the tune. I'm about to lose. Man. Jimmy fell off. Bro. Nah, Jimmy's still tough. Man, he fell off. Nah, Jimmy was saving them every time. I was like, cover Jimmy. 
Cover Jimmy. LeBron's the GOAT, bro. I don't care. They beat the Knicks. They beat we the Knicks up, man. You can't get into that. LeBron, nah, LeBron, nigga, goat. LeBron is the best nigga in the fucking league. I can talk LeBron day. all day. No, I'm not even on the the young niggas be bullying LeBron now, I'm though. They're not, like, bro. didn't LeBron you play with my shit. dad? Yeah, yeah. I, don't, I don't even fuck with that nigga. They be fucking with him. LeBron number one, bro. Who you fuck with? You better not say Curry. Nigga. Well, Curry, that's your Curry, the best shooter ever. Yo, Curry, he's good as hell. He's the best PG. Anytime he shoots, he wins. He yeah, shoot, he miss. His OG bro. niggas in the league did way bro, more than he, that nigga. Bro, he's the best PG of all time. I ain't best shooter. Lie. Ask, ask who Chris, put bro. more? Who put more threes up to him? Me, all time. Me, me. That's just threes, though, bro. LeBron, <laughs> the best player bro, ever. Ask Chris, bro. I really. I'm talking about Kirby, PG. Bro. Ever since they beat them that one I'm not time, I'm talking about small forward. I don't give a fuck about PG. I'm talking about, about, with that shit. I'm talking about best player of all time. Oh, MJ. Yeah. Bro, nah, bro, we can't have this stuff for hours. MJ, bro. Bro. we won't even get into this. We shit, have to now. Bro, LeBron is MJ, bro. All right, bro. No, it's not. Let's, MJ, MJ, let's be valid, real. bro. No, it's not. What let's I want to say is, what I want to say bro. is, bro, he beat all his records before he even fucking became fucking. Right. What is he? LeBron scoring bro. leader. Oh God, nigga. He bro, carried mad teams. Bro, LeBron came in when MJ was playing in his prime. Bro, and nah. MJ, MJ would have retired be... the same year. LeBron, LeBron got drafted. Washington in the one on one. No, he wouldn't. Yes, he would. Wait, wait, wait. What the fuck? LeBron is in when, when, when Bron first started, and MJ first started. If they was, if they was both together for me. MJ LeBron straight out of high school. He from Jordan, North what Carolina. Yeah, yeah, that's a fact. He did. He came out of high school at eighteen wearing that jersey. What a bro, bro. He really raw. He went bro. to North Carolina, Jordan, bro. Come on. He went to North Carolina. What's wrong with North Carolina? Carolina? Out the what's, wrong? Came, what's wrong? LeBron with the came Carolina? right out of high school, bro. He's he got him. more. He got Scoring way more. Leader. Jordan got what, way more shit title? going on. He got way more like time and training, like you know. I respect LeBron so much. Me too. That's my favorite player, bro. Too. Like real shit. What y'all think about Kobe? COVID, I already got that shit. I caught it before. Well, I was high fake. as shit when I caught it too. I thought the part. COVID fake. COVID is not fake. That's just fake. Didn't you have COVID? That's a flu. <laughs> Nigga, didn't you? Didn't we all have COVID at one point? That's a flu, bro. Oh, shit. I had COVID. I might be the day. August 26th, bro, 2022. I left the park smoking. Out of wood. I was feeling fucked up. I didn't know it was in the wood, but I was laying on the floor with my eyes closed and shit. And I took a test the next day, found out I had COVID, man. But I don't know how I got that shit. I don't know who gave it to me or whatever the fuck happened. But I know I was smoking that whole time I had COVID and that shit went away in four days. My shit wasn't even that bad, honestly. I was just sleeping and sweating like a motherfucker. Did you guys lose taste or smell? Nah. I don't know. When, nah. I, when I had COVID, I didn't. Nah, I was chilling, honestly. I think I only had that shit once, but I didn't lose my taste. Which I kind of wish I did so I could start eating my motherfucking salads and all that shit, motherfucker. But I didn't lose that shit. For me, which for me, I think I think best part of Jersey. Oh. For me, I say I say oh. like Atlantic. I, I fuck with Atlantic City, Newark. Nah, that's funny as hell because the people that were just here before you were saying that there's nothing in Atlantic City. It's literally just hookers and shit. I've been Bro, there one time. I've been there a couple times. That shit fun. One time. That shit actually fun. It's not. It's not even just hookers down there. Like if you. Niggas say Jersey ain't, you feel me, ain't it and shit, but you gotta explore, bro. I ain't gonna you lie. You really gotta explore Jersey to have I ain't gonna lie. We've been to Jersey our whole lives, and I still don't want a Jersey. Jersey's ass to me. Where do you wanna go? I wanna move to Atlanta. Get off my deck. No, but let's not get on get that. Get off my deck. Let's not get on that. Get off my deck. He wanna move. Shut up, nigga. He, he wanna move. Shut up, it. nigga. He wanna move to go be trading. Nah, bro. this nigga's on deck, bro. You <laughs> saying Atlanta got the most transgender people there? They I don't, do. I don't give a fuck, nigga. What did your mom show me, nigga? I, I swear to God, bro, smooth. I kid you not. His mom sent mad transgender people and mad straight people from Atlanta on his phone to see if I could point him out. I got him right. Where the bro? I got him right. I got, I got the straight ones right and the transgender ones who was transgender. You do know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna get caught up if I move to Atlanta when I get my paper straight. I'm just letting you know it's the most popular for trainees, bro. Not for me. Not for me. For me. Not for me. I live it's the most county. popular for guns. Guns? You for real? Mm-hmm. Damn. I don't even know that shit. I ain't even gonna lie. No, I'm just saying that. I'm pretty sure. It has to be, but I'm not even worried about that extra shit. I like, Atlanta got, it's cheap, bro. It's mad cheap. And you got this land down there. So that's what I'm trying to do. Ain't that much land. It's a, it's a lot of land, though. Ain't for me. I thought you wanted to move to Chicago, nigga. Nigga, shut up, nigga. <laughs> Fuck what I moved up there for. That's what you were saying last summer, I swear to God, nigga, say some boys in You said that last yeah. summer of the gods. You gotta not say that. It was either Atlanta, Houston, Miami, or LA. But LA too expensive. And Atlanta cheap. Yeah, it's like $14 a water bottle. Exactly. What really, but what really brought you out there, like, trying to make music up? 
Like what what rapper? Damn man. I ain't even gonna lie. I don't even I nah, got Chris I got Paul's on the Warriors. Huh? Chris Paul's on the Warriors? Yeah. Damn. Right like I was saying, but that shit does happen. I, I don't know what really made me start. But I got people that inspired me, honestly. Like I got homies that do my shit, like my homie Dre. He inspired me because like we grew up like we didn't grow up in the same spot, but we live in the same town, you dig? Grow up at the same time. So it's like I see him, that's my boy, so it's like I seen him working from like start to finish since I was a shorty, like twelve years old. You know, I'm sixteen about to be seventeen now. I've been seeing him work hard as hell and getting to achieving his dreams. You dig what I'm saying? But it's like I always been liking music. Like ask anybody, like I always was like rapping. Like I'm always going overly doing like if I hear a fucking song on the radio or some shit, I'm always going like hand on that shit. Or like if we freestyle me and Key, we used to be freestyling um toe to toe back in Kingsburg when before he moved or whatever. But we freestyle all night with my cousin Khalil and that's all we do. We just chilling. And I just, like, picked up on that shit. Like, I made my first song probably, like, almost a year ago. That shit was doo-doo. I ain't gonna lie. That shit was called Proper. I deleted it, like, 20 minutes after I posted it. And that shit was ass. Like, it was not... It was off the phone. All that shit, gang. But I just had to stack up my chips, honestly. Stop bullshitting. Stop being lazy. And finally get up in the booth. It's not the first... It's def, this is the first time. Definitely not the last, though. From a homie Q. He finna record some shit, too. And we him got some shit coming out soon, too. I ain't gonna lie to you. We finna come here and record that shit, probably. Or the bro, we finna get right. You fuck with, you fuck with, you fuck with. This it's a lot of shit with Dirk and Wild Beer. Who you fuck with more though? Niggas know I fuck with Dirk. You already know. Yeah, Never I'm Dirk. Know. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh, hell no, Wild Beer. This nigga's a Wild man. I like Wild Beer. Nah, Ain't nothing wrong with Wild Beer. I just love Dirk. But no, like, Dirk hard, but I got people, no people put in the argument that YB got more numbers, but that's because he's releasing every week. Yeah. Well, all y'all, well, he's releasing Dirk an now, album uh, every but week. Dirk got more money. Uh, Dirk got more money. On the guys, Dirk. But Dirk, Dirk, more but Dirk, Dirk say some real shit on most of his songs. YB just be bullshitting. I'm not gonna lie, YB do be. But it sound good though. That's all that matters. Yeah, all that matters is sound good. Though. At the end of the day, but that nigga Dirk, he got his. I heard he got his own car business, his own trucks and shit, his own company. But like. Delivering food. Well, we just talking about shit. rapping. We, we ain't talking about that. He about, about to get rapping. his own. He about to have his own. We ain't he talking about, about like financial I'm shit. I'm saying in general. You are talking about rapping. In general. Rapping. In general. <laughs> he about to get his own uh, fucking label and shit soon. Who? Dirt. What? Dang, he, get, he got his shit, dang. OTI? Oh, yeah. <laughs> he bad OTI. I don't even know when he got that shit. Like, probably, like, I was, I thought, like, Three six years, years old. Ago. Nigga, he been... Had that OTF shit for the longest, right? No. Come on, slow. He ain't had that shit since. Or maybe just like. Bro. Oh, he was probably saying OTF Touch for the longest, but. Yeah. Oh, the label shit probably like. He got that label shit like three, four years ago, I'm pretty sure, though. Yeah. Because he got that shit right before Vaughn died. R.I.P. Vaughn. Yeah, that nigga, bro. That nigga was a go. I don't care. He was a go. Nigga, actually, I cried when he died. Like, I ain't gonna lie because, like, I just, I don't know, man. Like, that nigga was different. Nah, you feel me? Niggas trying to say he's a uh, serial killer and shit and all that. Like that shit. I'm not about but that. But it's not. New Jersey. But you feel me? I want to. I want to put him as a serial killer. Killer. You feel me? It's just shit that happened where he was from. So shit pops off and all that. Everybody got problems in life though. Anywhere you move is gonna be problems. It's never gonna be all peachy and fun. You dig? It's always gonna have problems. No matter if you move to the burbs, like like anywhere, gang, the hood, anything. It's always gonna be a problem. It's always gonna be somebody who has to say something about you. Anything. You got a lot of friends in Newark and shit too. I cut, I cut them off. I ain't go with them. Like I don't, I don't fuck with that much people back there. They all weird and all that shit. Like they all be on their own. Like, and then some of them niggas, they just, they expect too much. Expect <laughs> well, yeah, they don't got shit out there, you know, God. Like, they man, don't, they don't got nothing. I don't. They still on like the drill way. Like I don't. Yeah. I don't hate on drill. Yeah. Like I fuck with it, but. That's not that's not for me. I can't. It's like everyone do the same shit. Like copy, they copy each other's beats and diss each other and all that shit. Like I don't got time for that. You feel he me? more melodic. He's um, he's more melodic. You feel me? But he could still he's versatile. He could still do that shit. But like me personally, I'm on that. I'm just on that drill wave and that somewhat melodic shit. Well, I'm talking about like New York drill. Like, you talking about New York drill? Yeah. Like, so let's say let's say this shit. The, let's say this shit. The car, right? Uh, this nigga press on the gas and then press right back on the brake. So we oh, nah. we scaring off and then he finally press on the gas. We start going like this. Nigga, and let's nah, say this is another car right here. Bad, let's bro. say this shit's like the uh, motherfucking rear view or whatever. Yeah, you feel yeah, me? Yeah. Bro, Nia had a grip on the wheel to kind of turn it because this nigga was about to hit that bitch. I wasn't gonna he hit nobody's car. Look at tell you. This is the this is the road, right? I'm the whip right here. 
Like this pinky right, my pinky finger is the car. I swear to God on my soul, I wasn't finna hit that shit. I know how to drive. I was finna hit the left. That's when I want to hit the fucking windows. <laughs> and then he drove a second time. Nigga, we almost, we drove, we we drove, we almost, we almost went up on that curb, nigga. Nah, nigga, we did not run up on no damn curb. Almost. He drove like a granny. He drove like a granny. Wow. I went to the parking lot nigga, and I, I had to hop out because I couldn't, nigga, I couldn't I only, reverse. I only went 45, 50 down that shit because I was trying to, you feel me? I drive, I drive like the Durango and shit like that. And Nia, you feel me? Her shit, her shit a car. So yeah, I tried to get, in, you feel me? I tried getting used to that shit or whatever, see what the difference was. Her her weird, like her pedals and shit a little, little loose and all that. So I just went like 45, 50 down and shit or whatever. And all that. That's why he told me I drove slow because I tried, I was doing that like K turn type shit. So, you feel me? Boom. Pop that bitch back in reverse and went back out the other way and shit. I was comfortable though. I was comfortable. They said I couldn't drive. I was I had one wheel, one hand on the wheel. I had the elbow on the whatever the fuck you wanna call it. You know? Oh, I was driving like this. Nah, I was not <laughs> driving like that. I was driving with the left hand. I had the fucking elbow on the At um, first he was shit. like this, then he went like this with the left hand. Mm -mm. I was like that when I hopped in the whip and then I took it off and it was like, slow down, slow down, slow down. And that's these niggas in the back flying in the fucking seat. Like, nigga, <laughs> Cause he was about to man. crash, bro. Was about to crash. Was they was in safe hands with me behind the wheel. Anybody who ever got in the car with me, bro, trust me behind your whip. On God, I'm gonna make sure you don't crash. Yeah, give, sure him, give, him, give him eight more months. Eight months? <laughs> give him eight more one, months. One month, man. <laughs> On God, I'm straight. I drove two times, three times in my life. And I'm straight right now. That was your third time yesterday. I can't, I can't do all that. Cause it's just, you're, I'm not gonna hate on them. They getting their shit out there, but it's just they sample each other's beats and diss each other and all that shit. Like it's nothing new. It's not that you feel me. It would really pop out to me and all that shit. I fuck with the New York drill shit. The the Bronx, the Harlem, Brooklyn, whatever you wanna <laughs> call it. I don't even see no niggas driving from Manhattan, but honestly, I fuck with some of them niggas, man. But some of them niggas, I just I just can't rock with. Like Chris, know, and you know too. I was just talking about it. I just feel like niggas ain't work. I feel like some people ain't work hard enough for what they got now. I feel like they just got that off of saying other people's names. You feel me? But for me, you got you got ten year olds out there making drill, drill, yeah, New York drill music now, yeah. and they blowing up because yeah. of it. But it's simple to do that shit. You it feel is because they got they got the they got the, they got the support, and they got they got something to say. But even though like they ain't in they, they ain't in the loop, but it's like they got a lot of shit around them. Honestly. Hell yeah. So like I, I respect I respect anything, bro. But like some people out of the New York shit, I don't respect. Now I moved out to Florida. Like, yeah. You feel me? As soon as I moved out, that's when that nigga Lil Tyler started blowing up. What you guys think about that nigga? Lil so Tyler, <laughs> I don't. I think he's funny, man. I think he's funny. I don't listen to his music though. But I don't, I don't, I don't, I'll be on TikTok scrolling. I see that shit. I feel like that's more like I want to say club music, but like is it? It was like off of that band last shit and all that shit. Hell yeah. Everybody that's was, the I type was on of band lab. I was on band lab. That, <laughs> I was too, but band lab is more for like the music he be posting type shit, you feel me? Like with Baby Tron and all that shit. Yeah, but I ain't knocking them. They they, they they get to the hustle though. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I ain't, I ain't like I listen to them on a daily basis, but like if they pop up or whatever, like I'll listen to it, I guess. Like, you don't fuck with Baby Tron? You like you just playing baby time before we put up to the stoop. <laughs> what about I wasn't paying attention I fuck, I fuck with baby time. I don't listen to him like that. You feel me? You got mad good bars. You from Detroit, right? Yeah. yeah. I like I like T. I like Skill yeah, Baby too. That nigga cool. That nigga raw. You feel me? Back back to what he said about the YouTube shit. You feel me and all that. Like T Grizzly, how he got his own stream and shit and all that shit. Yeah, that shit valid. That shit tough. Grizzly gang. You feel me? Sure. He make music and then he got his own like he be streaming and doing role plays on that GTA server and all that shit. He's making bread off that, yeah, right? Bro, yeah, he, he make mad bro. That's what Key trying to be on. He doing toys on 2K. I'll be on 2K. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm, I'm a little fan. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I'll cook all these niggas though. That one don't smoke nah, on the court. What happened in the my court with you and Lil though? What you talking? You about? You got dropped off. Oh, nah, bro. We'll see. <laughs> say, look, what really happened was right. You got dropped off. I have they be on the game all the time. I hopped on 23 for the first time since it came out. And I like had like an 80 overall brown shirt. Like niggas on my deck, they go over here going try hard, fucking off the backboard, fucking 360 dunks trying to like fuck my deck, like niggas tripping. Niggas know I'm not raw like that, my player don't got no upgrades. But I'm, I'm nah, fuck no, I'm, I'm ass right now in real life, though. Niggas with that smoke on the court. I got bad stamina, my lungs is fucked up. Smoke too much. I got three minutes in my heart until I like crash up. <laughs> Last night, I was in, I was in, I was in the basketball nigga, court. Boy, we, was, we was just fucking around. That nigga ran like two steps out of breath, bro. I was like, God. Oh, yeah, I put damn. the hoodie on. 
put my feet up. I was laying on the fucking court like this, laying on my back, listening to No Cap lean on me. I just felt I got on my bag, nigga. I was all fucked up. I was missing shots, a whole bunch of shit, man. Niggas don't want to see me on the court. Honestly, they don't. I'm gonna be fucked up over there. Yeah, you'll be on the ground, nigga. No defense. No defense. No defense. Who'd I rip last how, night? How you gonna play defense if you're on the ground? Who'd I rip before I lay down? Who? I, I ripped Lil. One play? Nah, that was raw. I don't care, nigga. I was on his ass. I was, nigga, I, I got a long ass wingspan, too, so it was like, feel me? Smack that ball. Ooh, fucking chicken. Alcohol or weed? Weed. 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 Uh, I don't really drink I'm like that, bro. Alcohol. Yeah. Stuff, <laughs> 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 Since, since you drink, tell them, like, why you think that alcohol is better. I'm going to go. For, nah, so you go first. I'm going to tell them my story. Oh, that shit just made me feel good. I feel like I could do anything I want. Type shit. But both of them is good together, but alcohol is where it's at. That shit get you good. That shit get you right. Have a good time type shit. What up, bro? How about you? But about me, I sip out. I don't drink out. He drink out. I sip out. I smoke hella pack, though. I smoke pack like a motherfucker. But I smoke pack, you know, the sticks and shit, but. I was probably fucking with that shit. I literally just got out poisoning like two weeks ago. Literally. Because I was in the car and I was I'm trying to get a bottle tonight. Just take it. Because we ain't got no school. You hear? So it's like, and I'm fired too. So I'm fired. I ain't got no job and I got shit to do. You feel me? Just like Friday. We'll be in the booth though. But like, it's Thursday though. It's Thursday? It's Thursday. Damn, nigga. Thursday. I be forgetting what day it is and shit. I be in the crib. So yeah, like, I flew in yesterday. Or I be out the way. For me, but. Oh, yeah. I don't, I don't like drinking like that. Like, I'll probably take like a sip or two, but I don't. I don't and smoking. I smoke time to time, but I, I barely do that shit anymore. He slowed down. Right. I just keep on getting worse. But fucking, back to the out. Like, I like took like 15 shots of like Malibu the other day, bro. I I was crawling. What? Bro. 15 shots of Malibu. In the Are way. you for real? Is I this a real he story? He said, he said he'd just be sipping, but he took 15 I shots. I kid you not. It's because I was yeah. crawling. How do you just take 15 because shots? Because the weed I had wasn't gas gas. It was like, it wasn't getting me right. So I said, bro, fuck this. It was my boy, Brian. Shout out to Brian. Set him in the song. Y'all gonna hear that shit soon. Brian fucking had a big-ass bottle of Malibu, right? So I just started, like, taking that shit straight to the night, bro. Like, I was just so fucked up. And then, like, I was chilling, though. I got to the crib. I was chilling. I didn't feel the out low-key. So I woke up. And, like, knowing me, like, I just smoked, like, hella pack. And I just drunk. So I'm supposed to be waking up later shit in the day. But I woke up, like, at 7 o'clock in the morning. I was, like, feeling all fucked up. My body was cold. I went to the bathroom. I threw up mad yellow shit, God. It was all bio, all that extra shit. Niggas threw up nine times. I was having, like, fake ass withdrawals. I was in a, I had a sheet on my back. I was shaking in my corner, nigga. It was bad. I had my cousin Lil pull up to come and fucking oh, kick it with me. alcohol poisoning. Yeah, I had my cousin Lil to pull up with me. I had grapes, bread, trash can, all next to me, God. But he had to left to go get some pussy. I ain't gonna cap. <laughs> but I don't think the nigga came back. But I seen him the next day, though. <laughs> he had to go get his shit. But... What you so for the music shit? What you think is best to get someone out there? You feel me, smooth. What That's what think? we're all trying to figure out. You feel me, like, see, I post my shit on DistroKid and all that shit. You feel me, so I can get the platforms and all that and all that. Cause I don't really YouTube unless it's like a music video. I feel like it shouldn't be posted on YouTube. Cause like everyone's just be like, you feel me? They want a music video when they go on YouTube and shit, like. For non music videos, niggas going like Apple Music and motherfucking Spotify and shit like that. But like, if you just starting out and shit, you trying to post your shit on like YouTube and shit, niggas look for like music videos and all that shit. And I think that's what niggas really want. I kind of started to notice that shit. Like, when nigga, my homeboy, what's it called? He made a music video off of his first song. He blew, he blew up and all that shit. You feel me? And with his second song, he didn't post a music video on that YouTube shit. He he barely got views on that shit. I ain't gonna hold you. So, like, I think that's what niggas really want from that shit. I just they just want something to, to entertain life. with the song and all that shit to go along with and all that. You feel me? Shit. Living my life, bro. I'm honestly just trying to... Like, I'm really about to go, like, head first into the rap and shit. I'm taking it real serious, you feel me? I might not be on my consistency I'm supposed to be, but... At the end of the day, I'm still finna punch in. I'm still finna get to this bag, even if I take a little slower in my process. But this is what I want to do in my life. I ain't going to lie. I'm trying to get into more shit later, though, like real estate, like I said, all that extra shit. Because I'm just trying to make sure my, I'm straight, the rest of my family straight, who's still here, all that shit. Make sure my parents straight, even though, you know. But it's really about that, honestly, bro. And I ain't going to lie. I was, like, always, like, a hustling ass nigga, even when I was a little kid. I was always like taking shit. 
Or is he just trying to get something either way, bro? I ain't gonna lie, man. Just trying to get something. Those niggas ain't have a lot, but you gotta work what you got. I'm trying, I'm trying to get some big ass land. <laughs> well, like, you, you feel me? Like, I'm trying to get one of those houses. Not all glass, but it's like glass. I'm gonna make sure them bitches bulletproof. You feel me? A what? Nah, a house. A house with bulletproof window? What are you trying to move to? I'm trying to get <laughs> land, but like, I'm trying to have like a big ass house, and you know, and like, where I'm at, niggas be on some. Because he lives in Jacksonville. I mean, so niggas be on some crazy shit and all that. So I want like a, I want some big ass land, but like I want to make sure my windows is bulletproof. So like if niggas ever try doing some shit, they can't break in and all that shit. You feel me? What about? I want some high tech security shit. High right, tech? You gonna be your own security? Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what you gonna have in that motherfucker? Chops, nigga. I'm gonna have everything. <laughs> It's stupid, bro. Yeah, everything that motherfucker. Nah, you stupid dog. I ain't gonna. I'm gonna have a big ass rocket launcher sitting on the wall. Okay. I'm gonna make nah. sure that nigga's 15 feet and boom, launch that bitch. Yeah. Alright, gang. Okay. Niggas know who I am, though. You know, Brazil, Big Ghost King. Niggas know. Chris can't talk my shit. Yeah. Right. Wanna do something? <laughs> what you wanna do? What you wanna do? Yo, let me get that stick, Yo, who wanna see my ghost? Nigga, my shit raw. What the bro? I don't, weed, Nick, anything, gang. I'm not smoking no cigs. I smoke blacks every now and then, though, with, with this nigga. <laughs> you feel me? Well. Yeah. I'm off no food and none of that. I know that. Niggas is definitely gonna have to eat this bit. Shit was decent. You feel me? And then I worried about we finna get some food after this. I'm hungry as hell. I ain't got no breeze. But I find something. You hear me? When these niggas supposed to get out? I ain't gonna hold you. I don't even know. Seven. Damn, Six, nigga, seven. that interview seven. But, you feel me? I got lost in the airport yesterday. <laughs> Yes, it was my first time flying. Made this nigga, I go to fucking North with this nigga, nigga pick him up. Fuck, that airport was about big as hell. I was trying to find the exit and all that shit. I started following the signs. These niggas just like, yo, we right outside. We out the door. I walk out the door, I don't see none of these niggas. So I walk, I'm just walking straight down at this point. Niggas like, yo, where you at, bro? We looking around. I finally reached the end point of the fucking airport, and I see these niggas inside, bro. Like, niggas nigga just like- popped up behind like a ghost. He said- Nah, I ain't gonna say my name. <laughs> niggas, niggas know my name. You know me, you know my name, but like, niggas know Braves. So I ain't gonna cap. But niggas was just like, say my name. I turned around and said, oh, this nigga right here. Nigga, nigga was coming up. Yo, yesterday we was driving yesterday. Niggas on my dick thinking I can't drive. I could really push the wheel. Nigga, nigga I told you I was going. Drive, I told him I was driving. Bro, Key was driving too. What, what he say? I said I went 80 miles per hour. <laughs> Shit, what? why did you care? I went 80, bro. I what? On That's really fast. Is it really fast? On the regular street? Nigga in Clifford. What? I bro. Had to be. I bro. Had to be. I was pushing that shit. Nigga, you go like 35. 40. Bullshit. That felt faster than that. <laughs> you was going for it. You was going 35. Felt faster than that. Hell nah. I swear to God. I swear to God, you was going 35 to 45. You was watching bro. the dash? Yes, yeah, I didn't watch that shit. Because right. y'all niggas on the deck, they was a nigga. I was, I had the wheel. They were trying to touch the oh. wheel when I had the wheel. Oh, nah. Yeah, they were standing on the crash. Bro, I was so just going to crash. I was let's, say, let, let's say this is the car right here, mm -hmm. right? The, at, the fir rail? at first, he didn't even know how to start the bitch on, bro. He didn't even know how to start the engine, bro. But look, he turned. All right, bro. We out of here, man. Shout out to my boy Smooth, bro. Big ups to him, bro. We out. Brazo, my homie Key, my homie Monty right here, gang. We out. Peace. Peace. Oh,